Let's do connections. We're finding four groups of four. Today we have a happy, pretty, shiny sky and a baby lady army navy. Putting army and navy next to each other. See, if you shuffle, then you don't get the info that they put army and navy next to each other, which probably means they don't go together because they always try to trick us. They're always trying to be tricksy. And by putting these so close together, they're trying to trick you into putting them in the same category. Uh, Tiffany, Livery, Colony, Really. Hmm. Mighty Daisy, very goofy. All right. Hmm. Isn't Tiffany a brand of uh, jewelry? Or maybe just diamonds? I don't know. Uh, mighty. Where did Caesar keep his armies? In his sleeveys. I love that joke. <laughs> uh, we just got very here. Very. We have very and really. These are just intensifiers. We have pretty, which can be an intensifier. Like he, he did pretty good. Uh, maybe mighty. I don't know so much about mighty. Um, is there another intensifier that might work better is kind of my question. And I don't see it. So I'm going to try these as intensifiers. There we go. Especially. Okay. Um, I don't use mighty as much, but I, I think others do. And it, it is an, uh, an intensifier. Anyway, they just put it as especially, which yeah, that works. Um, hmm. We have baby and we have lady. We have Goofy, and we have Daisy. Aren't Goofy and Daisy both characters from, uh, like, are they both Disney characters? Like Daisy Duck and Goofy. Um, are these all ducks, lady, baby, lady? I don't know. I want to say they are, but I could be very wrong about that. Let, let's keep that in our pocket, and let's see what else is going on here. We still have Army and Navy and Colony. We still have Tiffany. Wait, is Happy also a... I don't know. I feel like a lot of these could be <laughs> character names from cartoons. Like Goofy, Happy, Daisy, Lady, Baby, even Shiny maybe? I don't know. They all end in Y. Every single... every. Wait, I just noticed everything ends in Y. Even the ones we've already done. Wow. Um, I'm very observant. <laughs> Tiffany's a name. A lot of these feel like they could be names, especially cartoon character names. And I don't know how to pull those apart right now. Sky could even be a name. Um, colony, how about not a name? Colony, Army, Navy, Livery. <laughs> those aren't names. Um, isn't Livery like the, uh, the, the stuff you wear to... to, sh to sh show your allegiance or something like that or your family i think i don't know if i'm defining that quite right but you know what i'm talking about right their livery is one of these categories going to be thing but with y removed <laughs> like this is just your liver um your liver and your shin and your uh tiffin <laughs> your bab your lad your arm, oh no. Oh no, my joke worked. Uh, and your colon, okay, so these are these are parts of the body with a Y added. <laughs> yep. Told you, he keeps his armies in his sleeveys. Um, let's see. Okay, so what are the tricks on these ones? And I also told you that army and navy wouldn't go together. And the, only, and the reason we knew that is because they were next to each other. If you hit shuffle, you don't get that info. <laughs> Don't let them bamboozle you, and you'll be fine. Um, okay. Do I still think that we've got, like, Goofy and, like, Daisy? I don't know. I'm thinking now Tiffany is a name and Baby. What would Navy, Lady, Sky, and Happy be? I mean, Navy's also a color. Okay, oh, hold on, hold on. Navy and Baby and Sky are colors of blue. What's our other blue color? Ooh. Are daisies blue? I don't think happy is a blue. Oh no, I don't know what the other blue is. Okay, well since I don't think happy is a blue, I'm actually going to I'm going to say that lady is our blue because I think goofy happy daisy tiffany might be names like of ducks. <laughs> no, one away. Okay, so not lady. 
So maybe Daisy is our blue then? Oh no, okay. Well, I'm using up all my mistakes. Tiffany, I don't think Happy's a blue. I don't think Goofy's a blue, so maybe Tiffany's a blue. Okay, Tiffany is a blue. <laughs> are these ducks? Or no, no, Goofy's not a duck, though. So are these just characters in, in Disney? Disney cartoon characters? Disney cart yeah, Disney characters, okay. At least I was right about the categories. I just didn't I didn't know which blue to use, and I didn't quite know exactly which character names to use. But I got it. All right. Pretty happy with that solve. The ending was a little bit sketch, but otherwise pretty happy with that. Um I got the purple second, of course I did. <laughs> My joke primed me for it. Uh anyway, how'd you do? Let's do the mini crossword for March 29th, 2024. Let's go. Fawn's mother, a doe. Like the Kereru pigeons of New Zealand, which fall out of trees after eating fermented fruit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't know. Starbucks size, grande? Uh, venti? <laughs> okay. When to go, go, go. <coughs> I don't know what that means. When to go, go, go. C in French. Uh-oh. I don't know. Aspiration. Dry? Wait. Um, I think Venti is the only one that fits. And this is, so this is not drive. Uh, one of 20 in a six across. Ounces. Took me a second. Join a contest. Enter. Save for later viewing uh, for short. Save for later. DVR, maybe? Baby goat. Kid. Uh, drunk. Okay, they get drunk. That's pretty funny. Went go, go, go. Raced. And C in French or aspiration, a dream. All right. And apparently C in French is mare, which I'm sure I'm pronouncing perfectly. All right. Uh, did I miss any others? Okay, went go 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 was raced. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to um, I'm trying to learn like the whole tenses have to match thing. So like raced is past tense. So I, one, one tip I saw, which I, I'm gonna pair it here. Um, it was from another TikToker, and I don't remember the name of the channel. Uh, but anyway, um, you can add a pronoun at the start. So like, he went go go go. And the answer needs to also be able to fit. He raced, right? It should it should be the correct conjugation and, and tense. So he went go go go. He raced. Um, so yeah, that that's interesting. Aspiration is a dream. Ounce, and I think I got the rest. Cool. Well, how'd you do? Let's do strands for March 29th. Today's theme is pardon my French. I mean, people say pardon my French when they curse, but I don't think it's just going to be a bunch of curses. So it might be, oh no, if it's French words, that would be even worse for me. But let's let's see what we can find. Let's do the, the border strategy again and completely fail to find two words on the border. Per usual, we've got curb. Um, is curb like part of a word? I don't see how. Doesn't mean it's not, I'm just not seeing it. <laughs> we've got real. Okay. We've got brie, brie, briel. I don't know. His own. No se. Okay. Um, tire? No. <laughs> sir, sit, city, ire, sir, sir it. I'm trying to do go around the corner as well. Those, those I tend to not see when it goes around the corner. We've got ret, we got wretch. Okay. I'm really not, I'm not seeing it though. So if they were going to do curses, I'm pretty sure they would be the softened versions of curses. Like darn, right? Or heck. Um, if it was French things, I don't, I don't think they'd just make a whole puzzle of French words, would they? That seems kind of unfair for people who don't know French, um, given that it's an English publication. <laughs> so I'm kind of, I'm not sure I've understood the theme yet. Hmm. What would our spanogram even be? I see F-R-E. Are we going to do like French? <laughs> I don't think the theme's ever been one of the words. <laughs> It's a little too on the nose. We have terse. No. We have wretch. I already got wretch. <laughs> okay, got it again. Um, Bretch. <laughs> Breath. 
<laughs> I don't know. What are we looking for here? How about this corner? I've got fire. Fire er. Lice. <laughs> what are we looking for? Pardon my French, just. Like I have two theories on it, and neither of them seem to be panning out. Fin. I just I just don't know enough French words, probably. But it's it's not just gonna be words in French, like there's no way. Could it be like excuses? Because you're saying pardon, right? Pardon me. Sometimes I feel like the, this game is just keep finding random words until one of them locks in, but I'd, I'd much like the game goes so fast once you've like clicked in what the category of the words are most of the time, uh, unless it's a category I'm not familiar with, in which case I still struggle, but it certainly helps. We've got cur curfew. Do we have curfew? Curfew? Darn. That's that. That felt like maybe something that might <laughs> might be a a lock in. Um Brieu, I don't know. The French love to put random letters in random orders. Lure. I knew that couldn't be it, but I locked it in anyway. I see final here. No. Why am I feeling we already had a euphemisms board? I think it it was it was euphemism was the or euphemisms was the spanagram. I'm pretty sure we've had that before, and that's why I'm thinking about it. So it's not going to be that again. Um, so what would pardon my French be other than just French words? I've got a door. Baguette. I don't know. <laughs> uh, croissant. <laughs> um, striped hats. <laughs> Cigarettes. I don't know. I'm just, just thinking about French here. Um, I feel like time just gets away from me in this game. I'm just... It, I spend so much time just staring at the grid and talking nonsense, and I find nothing. I think I just need to start doing words, but I'm honestly having trouble finding words. This is going to be another long solve unless I figure out the theme soon. I see I-O-N. I mean, anion is a word, but I don't think it's going to be that. Um, I'm wondering if I-O-N is like the ending to our spanogram. What would, what would it be, though? We have we have N I O N or we have L I O N, just lion. <laughs> I'm not seeing it. I want to see it, but I don't. Loin. <laughs> hmm. War. <laughs> I can only see short words. Okay. Could it be words that you can put French before or like are like French fries, right? French toast. Are any of those in here? I don't know, the French Alps. <laughs> like, what, what would we put French before? Like, I feel like if it was that, we would have fries and toast in here. There's so many vowels. Look at all these vowels. Double, two U's here, E-A. French love their vowels that are silent. So I'm wondering, I wonder if there's a French word or two hiding in here. I see, uh, I see chic. Oh, okay. Okay, so are we just talking, are we just French words? Like maybe English words borrowed from French because like we you would use chic in English almost <laughs> there are so many English words borrowed from French though so maybe more stereotypical French things I'm not sure the French love to put vowels in certain orders <laughs> is it E-A-U oh, you know I, I think I see bureau is that it bureau okay then we've got loneos <laughs> Okay, not not Loneos. Um uh, or something. Uh si si uh, what is what is going on here? We have S O N. So something's coming through here. Or here, I guess. Or here. Yeah, there's I mean I I don't think this is a word. I don't think we can make a word out of these letters. So I think I think what I'm saying is I think we escape out. What goes through this bottleneck? Is it the spanogram? Maybe I should look up here and see what might come through here. I, I O N's not possible anymore because it isolates this L. So maybe we think about that. L N. I don't think we do like O L N. We do like I O L or A O. Oh wait, I think I see liaison. Can we can we make liaison? How do you even spell that? I guess it would be like this. 
Okay, <laughs> word three. Um, I feel like I'm fumbling my way through this. A what? what an, is it L A O L O A? Maybe loaf. A loaf of a loaf of bread. <laughs> I can't think what would end in A O L. I feel like starting with L O A is better. Loaf loaf of bread loaf <laughs> loafer no because maybe maybe loafer this way oh darn okay i guess that's not french is there is this our spanagram or are we just going left to right on our spanagram it's kind of my next question i want to i want to focus on this loa or pot like can we end in aol i don't see how we would right so i think i think it's an loa word low loan <laughs> Loan something, loan, low, loan word, loan words. <sighs> okay. Just dancing around that for a while. Okay, now th th this has to be one, right? Ap aper, aperitif. Oh, wait. Ap it's got to be, it's got to be coming from this A, right? Because we're not ending in repa or fepa. So, up, aper, aperif. It. Wait, what? I swear I'm not. I'm not doing a bit here. Apefriti. <laughs> Do we end an EPA? Fitterepa. What is this word? Okay, I'm gonna come back to that. Um, what do we have over here? Like re ref. So there. This is gonna be one word, and I guess we have two words over here. Ooh, wait. I see beret. Okay, two words left. This word and this word. Oh my god, they're long. How the heck? Sha is it like chauffeur or something? Sh is this how you spell chauff chauffeur? <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah, that French spelling is just not my forte here. Um, I still don't know what this is. Aper aperitif. Wait. A aperitif? Aperitif. Aperitif. A <laughs> what is that word? I'm going to look that up. Hold on. Okay, so aperitif is apparently a drink to whet the appetite or something like that. Never heard that in my life. I'm not much of a drinker, though. Uh, all right. Well, that was that was, that was was painful. I didn't, I didn't like this one. French spellings. Ugh. Chauffeur. <laughs> it says chow fear. And then we had bureau... I knew the two used next to each other had to be something, but and then it was loan words, so it wasn't even French. Like the <laughs> the spanogram itself wasn't even French. Um, liaison. Everything was hard. None of these were easy. Okay. Anyway, how'd you do?